Bros. It is Dash Optic Midnight, and today I'm back. I'm back on YouTube. I'm back from my little tiny, I don't even want to call it a hiatus, uh, just a little mini period of time where I was not posting. Um, and that's that's my own fault. I'm going to explain to you guys why, uh, what kind of ca caused a little interruption in the cycle of my YouTube videos and streams, actually, over on my twitch.tv i don't know can you guys even see my shirt hello boobs no but anyway so uh if you guys know obviously i posted a of <laughs> i i've always wanted to do a hotel vlog right and so at the hotel i was in the room had fantastic lighting like i was like yes i'm totally gonna be able to make a vlog in here and then i used my iphone and i have a i have an iphone uh 4s the old one. I'm wait. I'm I'm holding on to this uh, until I can get the six. I don't want to get the five S because it's too close to the six. I think to get the five S. So I'm just kind of I'm holding on with this phone right now. So anyway, I recorded it and I was in a hurry. I had to go catch like my ride right after I made it. So I was like uploading it while I was waiting for my ride, and. Uh, and it turns out it looks like it was recorded with a potato. The lighting was awful, my face was cut off, and there was like, my camera was having a seizure. So, I'm so sorry, I'm back in my in my element here. I'm using my actual camera that I use to record vlogs and my nice Blue Yeti microphone there. Um, so, it's good to be back. Uh, but let me just tell you guys why I went to LA uh, as much as I can anyway. And why, why the interruption in, in content, because I, like any other YouTuber, I should have planned ahead. I knew the trip was coming up. I did not schedule any videos while I was gone. And the reason for that was just because I, I was like, you know, I, I don't want to. I don't, you know, I'm not going to do stuff that I don't want to do. But I feel like, especially with Titanfall coming out soon, and just a few other ideas I have running through my head, I'm really excited to start uploading content for you guys. So, uh, with that being said, why I went to LA? I went there to play Titanfall. I went for a Titanfall event. That's about as much as I can say. Um, I am under NDA, so I literally cannot disclose pretty much anything else. <laughs> All I could say is that I went to a Titanfall event. I was, I was there with a bunch of other YouTubers, and uh, it was like the first event where I met YouTubers like in mass amounts. You know, I've seen YouTubers at like MLG events and stuff like that before. But, you know, I met like pretty much every YouTuber I've ever wanted to meet, except for Hutch wasn't there. So he was probably like the only person I've ever wanted to meet that I didn't get to meet. Um, but I met like C Nanners, Woody's Gamer Tag, Philip DeFranco was there. By the way, he is the best human being on the planet. Use code MIDNIGHT to get 10% off Control Freaks for your best controllers ever. I met just, I mean, I met only with Blade for the first time. Blade super, I mean, you can, you can tell which YouTubers are truly genuine because they come off in person like they would in their videos. So. Um, and then you can tell which ones are just, you know, kind of introverted or just not really as they are in front of a camera, which there's nothing wrong with that. I don't think there's a, a, a wrong and a right way to act in front of a camera and not in front of a camera. But I'm just saying, like, when I was walking with Blade to this restaurant, it was like I was listening to an Only Disney Blade commentary on the way to the restaurant. <laughs> but anyways, guys, so anyway, uh, I'm not allowed to give my impressions of Titanfall until a certain date that I can't even say, but I will say it is soon, and I will say I do have awesome footage. I was re-watching it last night, and I was pretty much just, like, jizzing over the footage I got. I was like, yeah, I can't wait to upload this. Um, so my, my only impression that I can give of Titanfall is this. That's right, mind blown. It, it was amazing. I'm, I don't even think I could say that, but uh, I'm excited to bring those videos out, so make sure you subscribe so you can see those uh, and stuff like that. But one weird thing I wanted to share right before I go, because uh, I, I want to have this video have some substance. Um, uh, it was right before I was about to go to the event, I was like, I'm really thirsty, I need some water. So I'm going to go, you know, a half a block. I was staying in Beverly Hills. So in my mind, I'm like, I'm in Beverly Hills. There is no shady stuff here. I'm not going to get in trouble or n there's no shady characters here. So I'm like, I'm going to go to the CVS. Okay, I'm going to go get some water, maybe a little snack uh, just so that I can have with me. And, and I was like, okay, so the CVS is like kitty corner from the hotel, like a half of a block. So I'm like, cool, I can totally just run over there. So anyway, I walk out the hotel. I'm about 10 yards away from my hotel and I see this bus stop and there's two people there. And uh, one of them was kind of stumbling around and screaming and he had like one of those convenience store mugs in his hand and he was like, ah, like fuck it, you could tell this dude was fucked up. I mean, it was like 4 or 5 p.m. So it really wasn't like time to be fucked up on the street corner, but hey, this guy was working it. So 
I had, it was on the sidewalk, and so I had to walk by him. I'm like, I have to walk by this guy. Like, it just has to happen. So I'm walking, and I'm, like, completely alone. I didn't choose, I didn't text a buddy. I didn't say, hey, guys, I'm gonna go to the CVS. Anyone wanna go? Like, I just went by myself. So I'm walking, and he's, like, in the way of the sidewalk. So I'm like, I have to walk around him. I didn't get off the sidewalk, but I walked near him. But I made sure I avoided his area because I just, he was yelling, and he was obviously intoxicated by something. So I walked by him. And I don't make eye contact, I'm just walking like stone face forward. I'm like, you know, I'm just fucking going. And I can feel him turn towards me behind me. And he goes, what are you too fucking good? And I'm like, no. No, I mean, I didn't say no, but in my head I was like, oh my God, what the fuck? He started talking to me. So I just started walking faster towards the intersection. And he's like, sure, you're too fucking good, blah, blah, blah. I'm walk by. And like, I was like, oh my God, this guy had to be in like his 40s. And so I was like, what the fuck? And the dude at the bus stop with him was like, calm down, man. And so I went to the pharmacy a little shook. I was like, oh, I don't want to fucking walk by that guy again. So I get my stuff and I come back out and the hotel, I can see the hotel. From where I am. I'm like, okay, cool. All I gotta do is make it there. And, but he's still at the bus stop and I really didn't want to walk by him. So I walked on the other side of the road all the way around him. I don't think he saw me just to get back to my hotel because I was like freaked out. I thought he was going to murder me. Actually, I didn't think he was going to murder me, but I didn't want to get yelled at again for no reason. But anyways, guys, that was a little random story. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video, a little update vlog. Um, I was going to do like a commentary, but I figured you guys would want to see me in the flesh and kind of see uh, just me talking, I suppose. So make sure to leave a like on the video if you did and leave a comment, what's the most random thing? Kind of like that bus stop story. What's the most random thing that's happened to you like that? I'd love to know you guys' comments down below and I hope that you guys uh, enjoy the Titanfall videos when they do come out. I look forward to making them uh, pretty much right after I make this video. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. Like I said, like, comment, subscribe for future videos. And that's all I got. I hope that you enjoyed the little check-in. Oh, and make sure to check out my Twitch. I'm going to be streaming tonight, most likely, or tomorrow. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm a little bit sick. You probably can't. But my voice is super sore, so I'm going to try to stream as much as I can. But I hope to see you guys there, and I hope you have a good day. Peace.